What's good YouTube? Reese Rockmanaker, a rock art fitness. Thanks for clicking on the video. Before it even starts, let's give it a like. Let's get 20 likes on this video and let's get it started. So what I'm about to do today is go to breakfast with Brittany, aka Rock Art Sister. <laughs> We're gonna go have breakfast at a place called Grass Roof, so I'm gonna take you with us. What is that thing? It is a freak shake. A what? A freak shake. A freak shake. Are you a freak? I'm calling it a freak shake. Okay. And then I got this the egg to cappuccino. I get my hands. It's like jumbo. So this is coffee and whatever that freak shake is and then we have breakfast now or lunch. picture mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so guys we're home so I didn't talk too much in that clip just the reason was because it was so busy and I didn't want to get anyone else in the picture so I just filmed my food and then I voiced it over but we're home now so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go chill on the computer edit a few videos and yeah I'm actually editing a certain video and you'll get more info on that at a later stage but yeah big things to come hopefully and the next thing I'll probably do is gym and then I'll actually take you in the gym and I'll try and talk to you guys for a change because it's Saturday and the gym should be pretty quiet so yeah hopefully I'll have a live commentary for a change so stay tuned all right so we're leaving to go to the gym now but something happened it's depressing and it might affect my session. My headphones died. Well, they didn't die. I don't know what's wrong with them. They might be broken. So I'm trying, hoping my girlfriend has the toe slip because she got them for my birthday in December last year. So hopefully I can take it into the place and see what's wrong with it because a session without music isn't really a session. So I don't know if you guys can hear me, but what I did there was warmed up to 100, ended up getting four reps. I'll check now if Brad actually helped in that fourth, but it felt quite good. Eh? Not used to holding such heavy weight, but I don't do in-ground press as much as I used to. But YOLO, Saturday I've eaten like shit, so let's see how much we can do. Maybe you guys can see me better now, but what I did there was three, three sets of pause reps, or three sets of ten pause bench press. Because now we're going to the proper workout, which is just hypertrophy. Yeah, I'm actually my strength back. Okay, guys, so the next exercise is flat dumbbell press. We've done incline, we're gonna hit a bit of that lower chest now. Three sets, ten to twelve reps. And yeah, I'll give you a tip after I actually think of one. <laughs> okay, so here's the tip. Instead of having your arm out here, tuck your body in a bit. So it's almost like you have 90, 0, get about 45. Make sure to keep it underneath your shoulder. The so will actually save your shoulder and it results in actually better chest, chest activation. So if I'm so awkward, not used to actually commentating in the gym, but I will get used to it.
Okay, this music is so freaking loud. So I'm sorry if you guys can hear me, but I'm trying to speak as loud as possible. We're doing three sets of 12 reps in each arm of seated dumbbell front raises. I started incorporating some isolation work for my front delts to see if it heals something different in my physique. Because you know, front delt size into upper chest, so gives the illusion that I have a bigger chest, hopefully. But that's why you play around. I do overhead press about once every week on my first push day after my first two chest exercises, but that's the reason for it. With this exercise, make sure you either use a hammer grip or a pronator grip. reason why, when you start doing that, you incorporate more shoulder compared to underhand uh, supinated grip, which is like that. You start using more of your bicep and yeah, just tip. Uh, so, next is table flies. What I want you to do is, with the machine, Make sure that it's about, about shoulder height, just underneath. And we're going to do three sets of 15 reps. Make sure to squeeze the top of every rep, and then don't go further than the rep. Any more than this, use the tension in the chest. Okay? Also it does make sure that you actually retract the shoulder blades, now it's even like that, even up and you get a good squeeze. Okay guys, so the next exercise is leaning dumbbell slide raises. The reason why I say leaning is because it gives you a little bit extra range of motion and it's studies have shown that it actually increases stimulus. I don't know, ask Jeff Lippin, that's what he says, man the freaking natural for a bodybuilder, I believe. Also, it doesn't have my which is good.